All right, hi Capricorn. This will be a next 48 reading for you. Use your own discernment when it comes to the readings. Take what resonates and leave the rest. You know what role you play in the story. You know what part you play, okay? May God bless and protect those who's guided to this reading. Take what resonates and leave the rest. All right, next 48 for Capricorn. Spirit, what messages do you have for Capricorn? Okay, the Four of Cups, the Will, and the Higher Fun. Okay. <clears throat> so, some of you could be feeling like uh, bored and alone. Okay, but you do have some sort of good fortune coming. Okay, in the higher front. So, uh, let's see. Next 48 for Capricorn. Okay. So, I feel like you manifested something. Next 48. Oh. Okay, we got the Justice and the Queen of Pentacles. So someone could be someone could be getting some sort of uh, karma in their finances. But I do see you having some sort of uh, good luck or good fortune coming. So the wheel is about to turn in your favor with the Ten of Cups at the bottom of the deck yeah okay or someone could have did some sort of magic on your finances what's the ne next 48 for capricorn yeah the tower moment okay tower so something unexpected is about to happen what's the four cups Four cups. Two minutes. Okay, I'm gonna take it. I'm gonna take it. Hangman, the cherry. So I feel like you have some sort of uh, wish fulfillment coming in fast. Okay, so so there's a need to trust. Okay. You have okay. If you wish to pray for something, I feel like it's coming in. It's coming in. What's the wheel card? Yeah, the King of Wands. So you have some sort of um, King of Wands. King of Wands want to come in. The Sag, Aries, Leo want to come in. Someone who wants to take the lead or lead you somewhere or I'm mean, here take you somewhere. What's the higher point? Yeah, judgment. So some sort of uh, light is being shed on the situation. What's the judgment card? What's the judgment card? Five of wands. to bring you some sort of conflict or well, someone could have backstabbed you mm, what's the king of wands yeah king of cups and a page of wands so I feel like you have someone that wants to, uh, someone wants to communicate with you. Could be a, a Cancer Pisces Scorpio wants to bring you some sort of communication, but someone wants to be like negative, or I feel like someone wants to be in control of you or control i don't know someone wants to control your finances what's the magician card yeah knight of swords
So someone doesn't know how to communicate. They fall in love easily with people. They could be having some sort of karma in their finances. So, I feel like you could be uh, moving towards some sort of um, money and stability. So, if you've been facing some sort of karma in your finances, you're going to move towards some some sort of uh, stability or this king of pentacles wants to come in. What's the queen of pentacles? So some of you could have um, separated or divorced from someone. the emperor so you're gonna get some sort of unexpected growth or unexpected abundance unexpected money okay after some sort of after some after uh, after um, some sort of setback or um, bad karma or some sort of magic that could have been played on you. What's the Knight of Swords? What's the Knight of Swords? Yep. Five of Swords. So someone played with some sort of magic, tried to see the evil eye, see some negative energy. They didn't want to see you do good. Someone didn't want to see you grow. Yeah, someone didn't want to see you grow or make money or, I don't know. <laughs> someone didn't want you to grow or make money. What's the Empress card? Yeah, so this was like a lover. This could have been a lover. So I feel like you're gonna be celebrating. So some of you could be, uh, you're gonna be uh, celebrating an unexpected pregnancy, um, a new lover, abundance, okay? All right. Um, so let's see. You could have had a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius playing with some sort of magic on you or Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Could be a Sag, Aries, or Leo too. So really all signs. Really all signs. I see all signs here. So Spirit, what message do you have for Capricorn? We have start a business. What message do you have for Capricorn? What message do you have for Capricorn? Alright. What message do you have for Capricorn? What message do you have for Capricorn? What message do you have for Capricorn? Messages for Capricorn. 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 All right, let's see what we have here. All right, 
right, you have angel protection. Then I said someone did some sort of magic on your uh, on your finances. You may need to cleanse your space. Okay. Go party with friends. Someone want to block your throat chakra. Take care of your children. Understand your gifts. Okay. Connect with like-minded people, people who are for you, okay? You have the eye of Horus, so some of you could be pharaohs. You're very protected, okay? Horus was a deity who protected all the pharaohs in Egypt. Zen, okay, be mindful, practice mindfulness, meditate more. You're going to have money in the bank. Something's going to happen during a full moon. God is good. You have good fortune coming. Start a business. God is always on time. The money gonna change you. So yeah, you got some sort of abundance or money coming, okay? Keep doing the work. Be better than them. Be encouraged, stay encouraged. Some of you could be healers. That's why Spirit wants you to understand your gifts. You're gonna be on to the next. Invest more in your business, okay? You're going to have a free mind. Eat more nuts, protein, and you could be a dog lover, okay? All right, so that's all I have for you, Capricorn. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And let me know if it resonates in the comments below.